Alright, let us quickly solve this Olympia problem. We are given that x raised to the power y is equal to y raised to the power x. Then we should find um we should find um x and y. All right. Now what to do here is you quickly tell them let x be equal to ky. Okay. We tell them that where k is any constant. Where k is any constant. Constant means any number. Okay. We say that k is any constant. Now, anywhere we see x, we can put ky. Or you can say let y be equal to kx. Anyone you like, we still give you the same answer. Okay? You can let, let's take it like that. Let's y be equal to we still get the same answer, anyways. Let this be equal to this. Now, I have that this is x raised to power. Instead of writing y, I will say kx is equal to what? Y, which is what? Kx all raised to power what? X. Right? So the next thing you do is you find the square root of both sides. Find the square root of both sides. So the square root of both sides means the square root of x raised to the power kx is equal to the square root of kx all raised to the power what? x. Now, this is, you know that square root means raised to the power 1 over 2. So this is x raised to the power kx all raised to the power what? 1 over 2 is equal to kx raised to the power what x then raised to the power what 1 over x now if you look at it this is what x raised to the power kx over 2 okay is equal to what kx raised to the power x over 2 i get it now now getting to this place we are going to have that um we are going to have that by comparison by comparison all, both of them has um, okay by comparison i'm going to have okay so let me have this like this let me have x is power k then in bracket of kx is the same thing so by comparison i'm going to have that x is power k is equal to this okay i'm going to have that x is power k is equal to what kx okay x is power k is equal to kx now I just want k to be uh, at a particular side. Okay, I just want k to be at a particular side. So what do we do? Uh, so let us divide everybody by x. Okay, I want k to be at a particular. So if I divide everybody by x, I'm going to have x raised to the power k divided by x is equal to kx divided by x. Now, according to indices, this is one. Okay, it's going to be x raised to the power what? k minus 1 is equal to this divided by this is just k right now when this crosses to the other side it becomes square root the root of that that is 1 over that okay so permit me to clean where do i clean now okay you say that y is equal to kx don't forget that we say that y is equal to kx okay so finishing up this thing so my x staying alone is now k raised to power what 1 over k minus 1 because if you have that x squared is equal to 4 then x should be equal to what 4 raised to power 1 over 2 okay so i have gotten my my x now for me to get my y i will tell them that i will tell them but but i say that what y is equal to kx so to get your y they will not say that what y is equal to k times what is my x my x is k raised to power what 1 over K plus one so according to indices this is raised power one so i'm going to have k raised power one plus one over k plus one okay so this is what k raised power uh the lcm there is k plus one so i'm going to have k plus one plus one so which is what k raised power k plus two all over k plus one so that is the value of x and y this is my x this is my x and this is my y so k is any constant put it one put it two put it three you will still get the same answer so thank you very much for watching please don't forget to subscribe